Welcome to Lakwe TV with you guy Ladid Diben. Today we, it's yet another episode where we interview our celebrities and guess who is in the house today? The one and only the, the Akbar. <laughs> Yeah. Jesus <laughs> rap knowledge. Yeah. Yeah. So uh guy, just welcome to the show officially. Man, thank you so much for hosting me, man. Yo, yo, Mr. yo, yo, yo. The band. It's good <laughs> to have you here. Thank you so much. <laughs> it's really been a while, uh, you know, uh we've had moments where we would sit together and we yeah. would do things and it's been a while. I know. Man. I'm happy to host you again today in the house. Thank you so much. Yeah, man. you're looking good. What are you doing to yourself? Uh, just relaxing and taking too much juice, man. Oh, yeah. And too much water for the skin. Yeah. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this is the only king of the hip hop yeah. in the region <laughs> of northern Uganda, Uganda, yeah. and Africa. Say it all, man. Say it all, my nigga. Say it all, man. This is uh, <laughs> Judas Rap Knowledge. Yeah. Yeah, I. Just, just before we get to the questions, uh, mm. I'm just trying to remember this moment where you had this beef with uh, <laughs> this guy in West Africa. What is his name? Caldenero. Uh, Caldenero. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, one of the, it's one of the greatest rapper from uh, from Sierra Leone. Okay. So he was dissing few cats from uh, around the, the continent. Okay. So he mentioned Calligraph Jones. You know, I'm I'm a fan of Calligraph Jones because mm -hmm. you know I follow his music too, and I like him. It's a it's a Jaluo yeah. from Kenya. Yeah. So I felt hot when I heard. Since you're Ilu, yeah. You're so I'm Ilu. like I'm like, why can this you know my my nigga reply? So. My my homie calligraph failed to reply him because I know he, he might be busy doing his other yeah, things. Sure. So I pick up the fight. I'm okay. like, yeah, I'm like, you know, I'm the lion. Yeah, I come from the land of the elephant. So let me represent my people. So I just did because that's my lane. You know, hip hop. You know, when it when it, when when everything comes around hip hop, I need to, I need to be you know active and represent. Absolutely. Yeah. So that's why we had that. You know, a yes, lyrical so, exercise. How, how did it end? Like, I, I um, didn't follow it much. I know uh, it was it was a complicated one because when I when I, he, I, I first diss him, then he re reacted back with a diss song called Village Boy. Then later on, saying you're the village boy. No, nah, no, nah, he means he's the village boy. Oh, okay. uh, but then you know, Sevillion is kind of deep uh, a bit. Yeah, so yeah, it comes sure. from Sevillion. So he was saying he's the best. In a continent, though it comes from the village, you oh, dig? Yeah, yeah. So me, I'm, me, I'm, me, I'm like, you need to protect your soul if you're coming against Judah. So I, I, I did a track called "Protect Your Soul." Mm -hmm. So from there, he had to send a boy for me. <laughs> you get? So he, he couldn't reply me. He sent a boy called Super Lodge for me. Then I just listened to Super Lodge. I'm like, ah man, I cannot answer him. I want you ahead, man. I'm, a, I'm aiming for your head, not for your boy. You dig? So it was just like that. You, 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 you are not willing to go for a puppet. Nah, nah. You wanted a big fish. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wanted the big fish in the ocean. Not the puppet. <laughs> nah. Yeah, yeah, mm. sure. Um. If we to okay uh, before we get to the real questions, yeah. Uh, what happened when 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 you won the award, uh, mm. MTN Pals, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. How did he say something about it? Yeah, you know, uh, when when I was I was in my yard when I was just relaxing, then yeah. I had a phone call from MTN that oh, you won this award, something like that. I was not there to represent myself, okay. so I sent some guy, my manager, called Chino Billy. That's the manager of Souls of Africa. Okay. So he went and represented me. Uh, he he collected the award and came back with it. But then you know during that time it was COVID, you know, yeah, so there sure. was no much gigs going yeah. on in town. Mm. <laughs> so yeah. That was a big news for Northern Uganda, you know, something like that to happen, yeah. man, we couldn't believe, but now it's like a recognition in Uganda, like they know now what time it is. Man, I know, I wish you congs at that time. Thank you, but man. still, I can say congratulations. Thank you so much. Yeah, you really did us proud. Thank you so and, much. And, and we, we can't wait for more of this kind. It's a blessing. Yes. Yeah. So, um, when we talk about Judas rap knowledge, the app bar. Correct. I think you have the longest name. If yeah. Say. Yeah, I want to take all over the space. You know what I mean? Like, you know. <laughs> yeah. If someone is to write I want to occupy the page. To, 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 to occupy. <laughs> well, 
because I, I she mm. even the title of mm. the video down here. Yes, yes. It's just so because <laughs> the entire thing is his name. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> I want to take over everywhere, man. You pages, you you know, you videos, you TV everywhere. I just oh want to take God. over. My name is a sentence. Oh dear. You get. Uh, to rule is in the nature of black men, you know, like, you know, back in the days before Africa was Africa, they used to call it Alcabalan. Yeah. So, you know, Africans used to conquer, like you go and conquer some places, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, yeah, so it's just like that. So I think I have that heart too, because I want to conquer places, because, you know, we are truly, we've been squeezed so much in our <laughs> land. So we need to yeah. occupy, yeah, you exactly, know what I mean? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So how did Judas rap knowledge the act bar mm. come into music how did he come into his music yeah uh you mean the start of my career yeah, yeah you know back in the days um i was in my like primary level okay then um there were there were the teacher was teaching then the teacher was asking pupils that um uh, what do you want to be yeah death by death what do you want to be in future then uh it reached his, uh when, when it reached me like uh i raised my hand and said i wanted to be a musician okay and the teacher insulted me <laughs> in in a, you know in the whole class you know everyone laughed at me that that's not a job you know what i mean yeah. so i'm like no but i just love music then they call my mom they sat us down like in a staff room and they tried to explain to my mom that me i will not study i'm too much into music then from there it, that thing uh, ashamed me a lot. Then I'm like, no, I need to prove to this teacher that wow. I'll be one of the best. And I met, I met, I met her. You know what I mean? <laughs> when she was coming to, you know, to just con congratulate me, she was like, oh, Judas, you're doing great. I'm like, oh, remember back in the days? <laughs> <laughs> so I, 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 you know, music is in blood. Um, yeah. I come from the family of Jennifer Lawala. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's okay. yeah from my mom's side. So Jennifer Lawala, everyone knows Jennifer Lawala. Yeah. So yeah, I come from that line of you know that blood. So the music is in blood. It's if in you see blood. Ayaki, then you can see it flowing. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, it's, it's just there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. I remember she did a song called La Cho. Uh -huh. Cho Mure. Uh -huh. Yeah. With Doki Sari. Yeah, 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 yeah. So Ayaki then is yeah, there. Yeah, many others. Mm. Yeah. Now, uh, if they say Judas. Right, knowledge. Mm. Uh, do we mean to say that your credentials have this name as well, or we do have uh, the reading? Yeah, um, 